You know, when I hear the words transit authority, I always think Bay Area Transit Authority. And they're the folks that had their own police department and shot one of their passengers through the back of the head execution style. What will you be doing to make sure this doesn't develop its own police department? <laughs> this edition of the Ridley Report is brought to you by LRN.FM. Feds don't want you to hear them. Are you with the Rail Transit Authority? Yes, I am. I've got a question for you. I have uh, been looking at the site yesterday, and I noticed that on the site, uh, the was it nhrta.org, uh, I believe. Okay. And uh, right on the front page there is an endorsement of a Democratic politician. So to what extent? Yeah, what, which one? I haven't seen the site, so I can't comment on it. You're you're with the authority, but you yes, haven't seen. I am. No, I'm, I'm talking about the authority's website. Yes, but I but I, that's just one of my responsibilities. Okay, so why is your website endorsing? It looks like endorsing a Democratic no, candidate. No, is it is it the authority's website, or is it the Facebook? Well, it says it's the website. It's uh, I believe the I URL think, is. I don't think there is any endorsements of it. It says something about Dan Weeks right on the front and how great he is. Basically. Well, I, don't, may, I haven't seen it, so I cannot speak to it. You haven't seen your website? Um, as I mentioned to you, I'm one of the members of the REL Authority, okay? That's one of my authorities. I have not visited the REL Transit Authority. I can, I can get back to you. Okay. Yeah, that's fair enough. And I don't expect you. I don't expect you to know everything. It's Dave Ridley, RidleyReport.com, Poor okay, Man's TV great. Station. So, right. but yeah, I, I have no knowledge of this. Okay. And I haven't seen it, so I cannot c comment on it. All right. I may ask you after you've had a chance to take a look. Great. And you'll have a chance as soon as you open your phone, I assume. Well. Hello. Yeah. Oh, you with the Transit Authority? Yes. Okay, I've got a question for you. Um, to what extent does, why does New Hampshire have to have a transit authority? Because the legislature set this body up in order to do this feasibility and everything else study of the, uh, excuse me. That's okay, I don't expect. <laughs> the, uh, they, the legislature set this up so that we'd have a body to, to go through a feasibility study and, and see why we want to do it. They felt this was the best way to go. You know, when I hear the words transit authority, I always think Bay Area Transit Authority. And they're the folks that had their own police department and shot one of their passengers through the back of the head execution style. What will you be doing to make sure this doesn't develop its own police department? <laughs> well, I'm very familiar with Bay Area Transit Authority. I've ridden on it many times, and I've been out there in the Bay Area. Um, I'd heard about this incident. I can't remember who it was, but... Uh, I, I don't think we're going to go there with that. I don't think this transit authority is about The main thing is to get the service up and running. And I don't know what they're planning to do with the police department. Well, that, that's a subject of discussion. Will you be doing something to prevent them from having a police department? Uh, I don't know. I really can't answer that at this point. I don't know. Okay, I appreciate your time. What's your name? Michael Lennon. Uh, M Landon? Lennon. Lennon, okay, okay Mr. Lennon, thanks for your time. Yep. Are you with the transit authority? I am. A oh, question for you. Why does New Hampshire have to have a transit authority? Why does New Hampshire have a transit authority? You're asking the wrong person. Yeah, so inside the meeting, someone just said this. So, 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 so nobody knows who this guy is? They're sort of talking over my questions that I was just asking them. Are you with the Transit Authority? Yes. Oh, question for you. I have a quote here from the Transit Authority website, nhrta.org. It says, quote, National Democrat Dan Weeks wants executive counsel to keep government open, unquote. To what extent are, is your bureaucrat website promoting Democrats? We're not, pro we're not promoting Democrats. We, what we do on the website is we just take correspondence and art news articles from different newspapers, different campaigns, and we post it on our website. It's, we're nonpartisan, and our goal is strictly to uh, 
as an authority, promote uh, passenger rail within New Hampshire. In other words, educate folks on why we need passenger rail in New Hampshire. So we take every article about rail and put it on our website. Are you going to take my video that I'm do doing right now and put it on your website? You can send it to our PR guy. <laughs> we don't have a problem with that. Well, I don't think I want to use taxpayer money, but thank you. <laughs> it's not taxpayer dollars. It's a volunteer organization. So there's no money at all from the government going nope. to the authority yet? Nope. It's all volunteer organization. No money is being spent uh, by taxpayers for this uh, rail authority. Although what it is, we're doing. It, I guess it's hosting your meeting, but I don't want to split too many there, hairs. So. All right, thanks. Sticker. Whether it's using tax dollars now or not, it sure looks like a government endeavor. So you guys are take it or taking advice from the MBTA? Is that correct? We got a presentation from Keolis on what they do. I mean, they're the ones that built the I-95 deadly kill tunnel. Why should you be taking advice from them? Where, where are you from? It's RidleyReport.com. It's like a poor man's TV station. It's a what? A poor man's TV station. And you didn't answer my question. No, can't do that. Federal agents on the streets of Keene, New Hampshire. They're investigating reports of an unlicensed radio station said to be broadcasting LRN.FM. So why all the fuss? What is LRN.FM? Well, it's probably not something these agents want you to listen to. It's a 24-hour news talk broadcast, all pro-liberty. A true authoritarian free zone. Tune in at LRN.FM to listen or broadcast their signal. LRN.FM Feds don't want you to hear them.